You may have heard it before, a prison inmate finding God behind bars. Many people can be skeptical about the apparent divine discovery. But there is one inmate at a prison in Dilly, south of San Antonio, who will tell you that prison is the perfect place to find God. KSAT.com's managing editor, David Ibanez, shares his story. At six feet, one inches tall and weighing nearly 300 pounds, Eduardo Navarrete was someone his homeboys could rely on for help. In July 2011, Navarrete was asked to help a group of people. So we kidnapped this uh, guy that he owed some money and it went south. We kidnapped him and he got shot. Despite being shot in the head, the man survived and was able to identify Navarrete and his three other accomplices. Navarrete was arrested, convicted and sentenced to 20 years in prison. He started his prison sentence in 2014 at the Dolph Frisco unit in Delhi. And it was, it was rough. Navarrete eventually made some friends, including some who wanted to introduce him to God. He attended some church services, but it wasn't enough. It wasn't until uh, I went to Kobe, though. It helped me realize how much love there was out there. In 2016, Navarrete attended a prison retreat hosted in part by Colby Prison Ministry San Antonio. The Catholic nonprofit organization ministers to incarcerated men and women in state prisons and jails in the San Antonio Archdiocese. The retreat begins with hugs from strangers. What was Navarrete's reaction? I thought they were crazy. <laughs> why is that? They don't know me. You know, why would they be all trying to hug me and Show me this, this love like this. The hugs were the beginning of a spiritual change for Navarrete. A retreat set the stage for a closer relationship with God, even if it meant it had to happen in prison. And to find them here is the perfect place because we're the ones I think that need it the most because of the things we've done, of the thoughts we have, of the feelings we got towards other men. David Ibanez, KSAT 12 News. Now, if you'd like to see Navarrete's full interview and learn more about the Colby Prison Ministry, just look for the story on our website at ksat.com.